guys, it's Kirby. Welcome to my channel. We are doing another dupe video today. All month long we are doing dupes videos. I thought a long time ago, April Fools, April dupes, I thought it was cute, so now we just do dupes videos in April. Um, I have purchased all of these products with my own money. If you are unfamiliar with what a dupe is, it is taking a high-end product and putting it up against a drugstore product um, that are similar and or the same to see how they perform, wear, price, branding, all that jazz. I know a lot of people have a lot of feelings about dupes. Um, I really like a good dupe. I think it's one, good to know what's out on the market, but also I think that People sometimes need uh, different options for price reasons, brand reasons, ingredient reasons, wear reasons. Um, again, I think it's just good to kind of know what's out there and what's available. Um, so yeah, without further ado, the dupe we are doing today is a face cleansing dupe. We are putting Pharmacy Clean Bee Ultra Gentle Facial Cleanser up against Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser combing moisturizing soothing facial cleanser i have used the pharmacy clean b uh cleanser before i think i got it in a boxy charm a long time ago and i like love it and then i saw this earth to skin brand in walmart not too long ago so let's talk a little bit about these let's start with pharmacy um Pharmacy Clean Bee is $28. You get five fluid ounces or 150 milliliters. You can find it at Sephora or Pharmacy Online. It is cruelty free. Their box says paraben free, formaldehyde donor free, synthetic fragrance free, phthalate free, cruelty free, mineral, mineral oil free. It also says our skincare formulations are free of artificial coloring, so the color of the product may change over time. Rest assured, this will not affect the product's effectiveness. We will talk a little bit more about it as we are using it. The Earth to Skin Honey Cleanser is $6.96. So how much of a savings is that? So that is a $21.04 savings if you need dupes for budget reasons. Um, you can find this at Walmart, Amazon. If you just type in Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser on your Google bar or whatever browser you use, um, you'll be able to find it. But they do sell this inside Walmart as well as online. And also I think you can buy it off of Amazon. No animal testing. It says no parabens, no phthalates, no petroleum, no mineral oil, no sulfates, no gluten, no animal testing. We will talk a little bit more about it as we use it. I have a full face of makeup on. We are about to wash our face. I'm going to take off my lashes um, and I'm going to use a makeup wipe to take off my makeup. Why I brought up specifically um, the artificial coloring on the Pharmacy Clean B uh, box or what they said on the box is because the Earth to Skin does have some artificial coloring in it. It does say yellow 5 and yellow 6. Uh, so if you are sensitive to those types of things. Just know that these formulas are not the exact same. They're similar products in that they're both honey facial cleansers, um, but they do not carry uh, the same like ingredient list. They do have very similar ingredient lists, but the Earth to Skin has some artificial coloring in it, and the Pharmacy Clean B has a few more like oils in it, like lavender oil, basil, all these other types of like flower oils and things like that. Um, just to let you know, their ingredient lists are not the exact same. All right, we're gonna get our face hair out of the way. Y'all know I like a good makeup wipe. I know I just got, did a review for the face halos. However, I have these at my desk right now. My face halos are up in my bathroom and I use them every night but I'm at my makeup desk right now. I don't usually wash my face here because there is no sink. <laughs> so we're going to quickly take my makeup off with a makeup wipe and then we'll get into cleansing. 
please note, if you use makeup wipes, I have no problems with that, but that is not washing your face. Makeup wipes are a good way to get makeup off of your face, to prep your skin for washing your face, to get all of the good deep down dirt and all that jazz out of your pores and off of your skin. I like makeup wipes because they do generally take the makeup off rather quickly without getting it like all into my hairline and all like gross and sudsy and stuff. So just know you need to wash your face after a makeup wipe. Okay. <laughs> I am going to try and use these products side by side simultaneously. Um, we're going to use Pharmacy on this side and we're going to use Earth to Skin on this side. And I'm going to try to do it at the same time. I don't know if that's exactly going to work out for me, but we're going to try. How to use, apply to wet skin and massage in circular motion, rinse with wa warm water, use AM to PM for the pharmacy, directions uh, for earth to skin, dispense cleanser into palm and add water, work into lather, apply to dry skin and massage onto, whoa, wait. So we are going to try to use these the, at the same time, but they have different instructions because the earth to skin says dispense cleanser into palm, add water and work into lather, apply to dry skin and massage in, onto face in circular motion, rinse with warm water. So we're going to try and do this. I'm going to read about what these both say as I'm using them. Pharmacy Beauty says what it is, a soothing ultra gentle facial cleanser perfect for everyday use. Made with sensitive skin in mind, Clean B lifts away excess oil impurities and makeup while infusing moisture with honey and hyaluronic acid. Why it's special, gently cleanses. This clean beauty face wash is formulated with naturally derived ingredients including coconut sugar and amino acids to remove excess oil impurities and makeup. Completely free of harsh ingredients, it has a pH level of 5.6 and is safe for all skin types. It's the perfect addition to any skincare regimen for dry sensitive skin. Infuses moisture, hyaluronic acid, glycerin, and other special antioxidant rich honey blend help maintain the skin's natural moisture barrier and leave skin feeling soft and clean. Soothes and calms, formulated with a powerful botanical blend and soothing turmeric, chamomile, calendula, aloe, and licorice root. Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser says, Hydrating cleanser is loaded with manuka honey extract and glycerin, both known to draw in moisture. Replenish by helping to create a protective skin barrier. The calming sugar-based formula lathers up rich and creamy and is safe for all skin types. Helps reduce fine lines and wrinkles for a more youthful appearance. Okay, so <laughs> I have a lot of thoughts. Let's start off by saying I probably <laughs> could have done a much better job of washing my face if I had both hands available to me for each of these cleansers. But when you're using them side by side, like you kind of want to try and use them at the same time instead of using them one at a time. So that being said, I don't think that I did like the best job of washing my face. And I get that. I'm not at a sink. I'm not in my bathroom. I literally had a bowl of water in front of me. Second, the formulas are very different. The Clean Bee formula, you can even see in the bottle, is has a much more liquid, loose texture. Um, and I think that's because this relies more on the honey and hyaluronic acid and all the other like flowery oils to help hydrate and soothe the skin and clean the skin. Whereas the Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser is very thick um, and I think that's because this relies mostly on the honey and glycerin to help to gently clean and wash your face. That being said, they also smell very different um, the pharmacy does smell like honey a little bit, but it does have a little bit more of like a flowery scent to it, whereas the Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser is like honey. It smells like very much like you just opened a jar of honey and like poured it on your skin, almost to the point where it's like a little artificial smelling. Not saying that there is artificial fragrance in here because I do not believe that there is. Um, Wait, there is fragrance in here. Okay, 
So there you go. There is fragrance in here. But it just smells like a little too much. It smells like a little too fake, a little too honey, a little like too on the nose, if you will. Do I think that these are interchangeable if you have unbelievably sensitive skin? No. Um, the Pharmacy Clean B is obviously going to be a formula that has higher quality ingredients and things like that. Do I think that these are similar products that if you do not have the $28 to spend on the Clean Bee Pharmacy, could you start with the Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser? Absolutely. And I think that your skin would respond well to it if you did not have any like allergies or skin issues with fragrance or like coloring or anything like that. So if you're looking for a much cheaper alternative to Earth, uh, the Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser is going to be right up your alley. They did a very similar job of cleaning the skin. They did clean the skin. My face and my skin feels very, very soft. Um, not hydrated, but it doesn't feel stripped, but it feels like squeaky clean, if that makes sense. These, I mean, yes, they're a dupe for each other, but I feel like a better way of saying it is that they're more of an alternative for each other since their formulas are not the same. They performed similarly, um, almost the exact same, but there are a few very like distinct differences with the formulas of how like thick and loose one is, the scents, and some of the ingredients. And I know when it comes to skincare, people can be very sensitive to certain ingredients. So if your skin is normal and does not have many issues with a lot of things, but you're looking for a really nice gentle cleanser to start with, the Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser, that's where you're going to want to go. However, if you have the most sensitive skin, breaks out to almost anything, but you're looking for a gentle cleanser, the Clean Bee Pharmacy is probably where you're going to want to make your splurge. Yeah, these are similar products. Definitely not the same. They perform similarly, and the packaging and everything is very similar, but they're not like the exact same product that could probably be interchanged. And I only say that because it's skincare, and skincare can be so touchy. Everybody's skin reacts differently to other things. So I know that if I use the Earth to Skin, it, my skin isn't probably going to be affected by it. But yeah. So, very good similar products to know about. More sensitive skin, go with Pharmacy. If you're just getting into skincare and looking for like a nice gentle cleanser because you use like a bar of soap now, maybe try out the Earth to Skin. They both performed well, nicely. My skin feels soft, it feels clean. I do still have a little bit of eye makeup, but that's because I wear a lot of mascara and eyeliner and stuff. I'll use an eye makeup remover later. Uh, but yeah, definitely impressed with how these performed against each other. Not mad by it. I really like both of them, and I'll use both of them. So I will list these products down in the description box below. If you are interested to check them out, you can do that on your own time. If you enjoyed this video, give it a big old thumbs up. Have you used Earth to Skin products? They have like a whole line, like fruit line, honey line, all kinds of things. Have you used pharmacies products? Oh, I love a lot of their products, especially the like honey products. Take me there. Let me know all of that down in the comment section below. Let's start a conversation. As always, please be sure to subscribe and hit the little notification bell. I would hate for you to miss out on any more videos. Thanks so much for watching, guys.